Dude, it is so hot in my room right now, and I want to open my window, but these freaking goons out here are doing construction right outside my window. Literally right outside, like, bro, I want to show you guys so bad. Look, uh, hold on, hold on, bro. Th th this, is <laughs> this is so scuffed. You literally can't see, like, anything. But, dude, my freaking, like, look, look at that. There's a whole truck out there. It, it's it's ridiculous, bro. It's it's literally ridiculous. But I, like, hopefully you guys can't hear that. I'm gonna do my best to make sure you can't hear that. But it's hot, bro. I need my window open. What's up, YouTube? Velocity here, and welcome back to your turn to die. Last time we did one of the challenges. Um, I think there's nine challenges we have to do in total. We did one of them. And everyone told me to talk to Alice. I'm not sure why, but I'm gonna talk to Alice. Everyone keeps telling me to. Don't discuss is an option? Why is that an option? Sarah, I have something to say about Reiko. Ah, I already felt like I'm about to make a bad decision, bro. I want to hear what he has to say, though. Here's a short pitch. Do you have any inklings about Reiko's treasure? Huh? Treasure? Yes. You see, I tried asking that must... Dashioed man at the prize exchange if there are items not present on the counter. It appears there is a secret prize menu. That is something I was gonna say. What? Like, there's gotta be more to this. They, they always like a secret menu. If you wish to hear more, come to the, to come to the negotiation table. Sarah, is that re related to Reiko's treasure? Sarah, I have something to say about Reiko, yeah. Very good. So what about Reiko? Right. You see, I tried asking that, yup, uh-huh. And he answered readily that there is a secret menu. Did you buy something? What's on it? There is a treasure. And it appears 20 of Rico's Meek tokens are required to purchase it. Wow. A treasure, could that be? Have you an idea about it, Sarah? When she first introduced herself, she mentioned her guitar. The bongos, the congo, the bondo. What? Did she say she had an instrument of some sort? Okay, wait, no, 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 hold on. I want to. I, I need to think. I'm not gonna answer yet. I need to think. Uh, I, I have to guess, bro. I, 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 I don't know. She doesn't play the bongos. The bondo? That's not even a thing. Is that the congo? I'm gonna say bongos. The bongos? That is inconceivable. No! No! Oh my god, why do you think so? She doesn't play the bongos. Do you know the name of Rico's band? I don't know. It's not like I would know. I mean, so when I try to remember, I felt something in the corner of my mind. Sarah, take a look at this magazine. You heard of him? This band's amazing. Isn't she, isn't she so cool, this Rico lady? Ugh. What is it? It was Skull Nuts or something like that. Wrong. Huh? But I thought it was. That's our current band. Reiko used to be in a different one. Samurai Yaba. I feel like that's important. I, either that's a glitch or it's important. There's no uh, there's no in between. Samurai Yaba, the band of legend. Want me to introduce its former members. Masterful of even the most temp tempt of scores, banging out tunes like many-armed goddesses. The keyboard player, Urshin. Urshin. The man who balances out novice technique with overwhelmingly demonic presentation. The bass guitar, Stronghold. The once-in-a-century talent, a mass of charisma, commanding an angelic voice and hellish growl. And the guitar and vocal- the gar- the guitar and vocals! Oh my god! I've been recording all day, dude! It is so hard to talk! <laughs> Reiko! And the the guardian deity of drums who protects the band's packs was me! Oh my gosh! Huh? You were a part of the band too, Alice? Indeed, though I can't play at all, so I tried to just blend in. <laughs> You can't play, but you joined a band? It was to round out the numbers. I also did things on the management side. 
I told you before, didn't I, that Reiko has changed now. She wasn't always someone who could get harmoniously with people. Get along harmoniously with people. The Reiko I knew antagonized everyone and was alone. Such that she wouldn't even approach someone meant to be... Meant to round out the numbers. I would always clean up the messes, search for replacement members and such. Someday she'd be grateful to me. So I believed, and I endeavored as an average older brother. It was in those times I gave her some bongos. Bongos? Haha, <laughs> it was merely a joke gift. As expected, she was indifferent. Her cold eyes stirred with no emotion. But it was then I realized... He's grabbing his chest. I didn't even realize that. Those cold eyes were the very same ones Reiko had whenever she looked at me. She neither respected nor looked down on me. She was simply indifferent. So to call those bongos her treasure? Don't make me laugh. Why not try purchasing it? What? If the treasure for sale is bongos, they might be the bongos you gifted her, Alice. Wow. Just collect 20 of Reiko's tokens. I can't. Do it. I, I can't speak with her. Then I'll assist too. You? Yes. I can collect her tokens, so please buy the bongos and give them to Reiko. That might be hard for him. Very well. If you insist, I'll have your help. Understood? 20 of Rico's tokens. Bring them by this time tomorrow. So I have to do it! I have to. Tomorrow morning? Obviously, I'll lose courage after more than one day. Right, understood. Once I bring them, please do give the bongos to her. Sure. He does look happy. That's it for discussions. Oh my gosh. Suddenly I remembered something. Is now still there, I wonder. The AI of Professor Mishima. Should go check on her, yeah. She is. I was talking with her gaze fixated- Fixed on a single point. Now. So then, Professor, while you were gone- It's like my voice isn't reaching her. I guess it's entirely reasonable. Mm. These are both horrible options. It's just unfair. As far as I can see, it's as if she's talking- BRO! I'm so mad. <laughs> I'm so mad right now. Smiling gently and listening to her speak. It's like a dream. How could you show her a thing like that, then bring her back to the reality of the death game? I wonder if it just- if it keeps on like this. Maybe now we'll- Even so, I can't stop her. I don't want her to be settled with the duty of bringing- I don't want to be settled with the du- WHAT?! I'm sorry. No! Is that so? It's been nothing but hardship, then. However, even amid such circumstances, you made wonderful friends, Miss Now. Friends? Indeed. Age and the length of your association are no relevance. They are wonderful people who help each other. I understood that clearly hearing you speak. Please treasure your friends, Miss Now. Okay. I've always been getting saved by them. So from now on, I want to be useful to Reiko and Sarah and everyone. That's why I'm going now, Professor. Yes, please come by any time. I'll be right here. Bro, that is so... Oh. That is so messed up. Like, I, I can't even begin to explain. No, I won't come here anymore. Miss Snow, you truly have gone, grown strong, haven't you? I'm honored to have had you as my student. Goodbye, Miss Snow. Dude. Someone give her a hug, please! I... I'm not strong at all. I wanted you, you watching over me always, Professor. Now, I was trying to look forward, to accept everything and face reality. Now is a strong person, much stronger than me. I should go. I'll do what I have to, to... To so... I'll do what I have to, to so much as to approach that strength. Oh my god, bro. I cannot speak. Day one, noon. Uh, what's that? Okay, I'm gonna drink water, bro. Give me a second. Huh? What's that? Quit with the stupid jokes, you. The biggest joke around here is your name. Kutaro and Ranger are arguing. I wonder what happened. Uh... 
Exploring comes first. You might find something besides attractions. Yeah. Yutaro and Ranger are having a dispute in the middle of the lobby. Damn it, you gotta be screwing with me. Yutaro, what's the matter? Sarah, this Ranger guy just said we can't go back to the first and second floors. I mean, you cleared them already, right? Hold on a second, Kai's laptop is down there. Who cares, we'll just confiscate that thing. No way. Damn it. It was unmistakably a clue. That laptop's the last thing I want to let you guys take. Ah. Uh, Keiji. Reku Tara wants to find out the truth about Kai. About Kai? What a troublesome guy, leaving mystery after mystery. Kai was a good person. I think he was. I wonder if Kai was a good person after all. Some aspects suggested it. His anger for the victims, the resistance against the kidnappers. Was Kai acting for good or for evil? Just whose side was he on? And we ended up making Kai a victim without knowing anything about him, yeah. I feel like I really messed up. I really do. But we can make inferences. Inferences? Friend or foe, let's consider the possibilities. First, Kai confessed to having some contact with the kidnappers. So one possibility is that Kai was with the baddies. Like a, di like a director of the death game, for instance. Yet Kai drew the siege card and died. In his last moments, he said he entrusted me his hopes. I can't imagine him as an enemy. Incidentally, Sarah, you really didn't have any acquaintance with Kai. No. Huh. Then how about this one? Something like Kai betrayed the kidnappers. And he was executed as an example? He did sock Miley, after all. It's possible he earned their wrath, but maybe that's not it. Then here's the next possibility. Kai was on our side, but had some sort of communication with the kidnappers. Though in the same situation as... Though in the same situation as all of us, he did dealings or missions in the shadows. Missions like what? Remember the first trial everyone took, right? Yes, that game where I was tied to a bed and we had to find the key. It wasn't the same for everybody. Didn't Gutaro say so? Yeah, for Gutaro, the trial was just to carry the box with Miley's head. Ah, oh, that's what you mean by missions! Yep, in short, Kai might have also been entrusted with a different mission. Like ensnare the other participants. No way. In other words, he was being manipulated like a disposable pawn. Ah. There's one more. Very slight possibility, but one your policeman would like to hope for. Huh? Possibility we've got an ally on the side of the kidnappers. I highly doubt that. But, that would be great. In other words, there's a traitor among them trying to destroy the death game from the inside. A person was in contact with Kai and had him assist with the plan. Well, Sarah, think that's out of the question? One of the kidnappers is a- it's... Not impossible! It's possible! I have no proof that we could fully deny it, but... The chances are very slim. It looks like you can't wrap your head around it. There are clearly some illogical aspects, so... Oh, that's all just my hope, anyhow. It'd be interesting if Miley was related to this, though. KG. Huh? I was just thinking. There hasn't been a past case similar to this death game, has there? There has. There has? There has? What do you mean, there has? What? It was decades ago, apparently, but I've read the files. There was a battle for or for influence between major crime rings. At the time the police were putting all their putting their all into exterminating these organizations. Those living in the shadows had it pretty rough, so crime rings started laying waste to their own. But if you're gonna mutually destroy each other, it's better to join hands, they thought. And so they executed a plan to unify the crime rings into one monolith in the ways of violence they're so adept at. Don't tell me that was, yes, it was a death game. Mutual slaughter with rules, scary stuff. The representatives had a grand battle, and only one person survived? That survivor reigned at the top of the criminal society. I think it was called the Hades Incident. Christ. Shot to the top of the criminal underworld, hence the Hades Incident. But ultimately, the organization collapsed afterward. Justice always prevails. The police do their job sometimes, right? How relevant is it to this? Not very, I think, since the organization collapsed and all. Besides, Sarah, you got any connections to the criminal underworld? You can't be. 
course not, alright? It's not good to go tying anything and everything together, Sarah. More importantly, you better get moving. Ranger was mentioning that the rest of the attractions have opened up all around here. Is that so? I think it'd be good to go look for them? So me if I can help out with something. This policeman will be your partner, Sarah. The attractions, I'll go look around. Alright. Um... Jeez. Okay. I... That was a lot of information. Yep, you already said that. Okay. You can depend on Mr. But yep, okay. Um... Let's go to the ruined corridor. Oh my gosh, Guitaro, you're good. You can let Ranger do what he pleases. Now's not the time for attractions. What? What do you mean? I was literally just told to. Okay, I should save. I should definitely save. I'm gonna save right here. I need to make multiple files in case I do something extremely horrible. <laughs> what? What am I supposed to do? Why are you saying now's not the time for attractions? You're literally just told to do them. Oh my gosh. What is it, Sarah? Alice, I take it you have business with the attractions beyond here? I thought so. Attractions appeared here? What, you didn't notice? My observational skill is superior. <laughs> Over there, and there, and here. Discovered three death attractions. You can select attractions via the move menu. Challenge them if you're up to it, and tell me if you seek my observational skills. Even if it's fake outside, it feels nice. Yeah. Oh, there's no need to be afraid. Right, I'm not afraid at all, so what did you want to talk about? Uh, yes, I wanted to know um, who you've traded tokens with. Oh, so he's doing his- oh my gosh! Wow, that is... that's a lot, man. Okay, what are these games? Quick draw. What is happening right now? What what am I supposed to do? Oh, Kana. Sarah. Kana. Hey there. So I I worried about you, huh? I worried you, huh? Kana explained it to me. It's just one shock after another. I couldn't blame anyone for being paralyzed. Uh Sarah, it looks like attractions have appeared in a few places. Yeah, so I heard. It looks like you can go to three more attractions from here, in fact. What? So there's nine. Look behind you. He's right. There are paths opposite on the side. Wow. I wonder, maybe some locations open up in the other... Yeah. Let's search for a little longer, Kana. Okay. Wow. It might be about time to continue with clearing attractions. Yeah. Um... Oh... My god, hide and seek. Participants too. Clear to, yep. While hiding from the wicked dolls, pull three levers until they reach max energy to win. Uh, let me look at the other ones first. Run away minecart. Get past obstacles to get in the way of the minecart and reach the goal within the time limit. Um Yeah. Stay on target. Stay within the bounds of the areas produced by your opponents. Defeat the three dolls to win. Nah. Let's do hide and seek. KG, let's go. Ah, let's see. Let's see what everyone. <laughs> Why did I do that? Why did I make that sound? As KG, energy will not decrease over time. That actually is really good. If there's a sprint meter. As well as your prisoner intuition warns you one second before the enemy turns around. Wow. Kana. Rate of energy filling increases. Okay. I'm gonna go with Alice. Avoiding Jailer's eyes is my forte. Rejoice. <laughs> okay, so what are the controls? It didn't actually tell me what the controls were, so I'm... I mean, it's gonna tell me now, I think. Hide and seek, begin. Well, start with me. Let us hide carefully. I didn't seek rules. Touch the three levers to move them. And build their energy to the maximum. Touch the rock to hide before the demon turns around. Not even dude. The demon. The demon. The Oni. Man. Alright. Okay. 
Touch the three levers, you have to move them. Touch the rock to hide. Okay. Touching your allies icon will give you advice and so the like. Good luck. Alice, you didn't warn me. You didn't warn me. Bro, are you not supposed to warn me? What is this? Okay, so he stops for a second before he turns around. So I know that now. Okay, okay, okay. So can I just get one of the levers to max energy and then do the rest? I can. Bro, you're joking. It gets way harder. I've already lost a heart. I've already lost a heart. This, bro, this, 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 what? this is not fair. It's not fair. This is just not fair, bro. Oh my god. I, yeah, I had way too early. It's okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're almost there. Don't get greedy. Do not get greedy. This is You cannot be greedy, bro. If you die, it's over. Alright, I'm just talking to myself, y'all. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, I was waiting for him to come by. No! <laughs> no! Bro. Oh my god, I can't believe I died. I can't believe this! Are you serious? Okay, so that's Alice's ability. I'm not sure what Sarah's ability was. Maybe it's that uh, the bar goes up a bit faster or something? I'm not sure. I can't believe I died as Sarah, dude. Oh my god. This isn't even all that bad. How did I... <laughs> I can't believe... It. Oh my god, the voice crack. Uh... Alright, come on. Come on, come on. That was so early. I shouldn't have done that. I knew it was the water guy coming, man. Come on. Okay, yeah, they're both coming. Wait, really? Okay, now the water guy's coming. Yeah, okay. No! Oh my god, bro! There are, there's so many of them! Okay, Alice, you are a goat, actually. You are goated. Greatest of all time. Yes, sir! That's my goat! Alice, let's go! Let's go! That was nothing much! Yes, sir! He flicks it casually. This is my goat right here. This is my goat, bro. Worry not, Sarah. We will split the clear chips equally. Nice. With that, this attraction is done. All right. Negotiation. So we should talk again. I'm going to save again. Because <laughs> I feel like... I, it literally told me if I talk to someone, it will alter the entire experience like it's someone oh my god i bro it, it, this is too stressful just talking to someone is too stressful for me imagine that imagine that i i can't i cannot with this game but i'm gonna talk to kana sir it's not a treat or anything but can we talk actually let me see what everyone has to say uh, that might be the best thing i can do here honestly to help alice complete his objective 
God, I can't choose. I'm gonna flip a coin. I'm gonna flip a coin. Hold on. I'm here. You see, I decided with Rico that we traded 20 tokens each. But you know, gotta cross a shaky bridge together. For instance, we could pass 20 tokens like this. From me to Sarah to now. Or pass them the other way, Sarah to me. I'd say the other way. This way we won't need to have extra trade partners in the future, see? So they're daring to trade them like this instead of an equal share. Yeah, sure. That's a ticket. So how are we doing this trade? We pass the tokens like this. Or else like this. That's a good way to give 20 tokens, right? Yeah, Sarah, you can choose whichever direction you like. Yeah, and if you don't want to trade, we'll do it ourselves, so don't worry about that. Um, I told Alice I would help him to collect Rico's tokens, but... I think this is the call, guys. I'll give my tokens to now, Rico. Please give me yours. Got it. Don't lose them, okay? Alright. Well, that's it for negotiations. Okay. So, I, I really do think that was it. Jin, are you okay? It hurts. What's wrong, Jin? Sufus went and did an, an attraction, and I couldn't quite protect him. Big sister, I'm okay. It's just a scratch. But you're bleeding. I can lick it better. No, that's not gonna help. Would be nice to have someone to care for wounds. Er... I, I don't like this thing. Would you like to go to the medical office? What do you want, Scram? But it wouldn't be good if the wound was left to... Yeah. You've got no right to be worrying over me, melon soda lady. Medical treatment for participants is just part of my job. I can't exactly believe you that easily. Are you willing to take a vow? I vow that I will cause him no harm. I won't go back on my word. That's not good enough. Yeah, I can't trust her. I'd be mad if she remodeled my body into some weird superhuman. Yeah, that sounds kind of cool. No, it doesn't. You'd do it if you wanted that much. I won't force it upon you, but I definitely do think you should get treatment. I mean, these things have to abide by some rules. I feel like if they just killed someone, the Game Masters would be pretty pissed off. They're doing this for entertainment, right? In that, it, it, following that line of logic, I think it would make sense to trust her to treat Jin. You can't just leave a bleeding wound open. That's not, that won't help anyone. I think we should trust her. Let's try trusting her. Sarah, are you serious? Yeah, if she's about to do something bad, KG and I will protect you. Sounds good to me. Thank you very, uh... Please follow me this way. Dude, she's so gross. This is the medical office. What is this place? Is it weed outside? No, everything you see is as outside is an image pr protected on the glass cabinets. An image? Yes, currently we're, dis we're displaying a soothing tropical scene. How do you like it? I don't. Hey, if you're right, it does feel nice. It feels like the AC's tuned just right for it, too. How observant. I actually managed this room myself. It serves as a, as a laboratory as well. So, can we heal Jin? Yes, the medical supplies are over here. Okay. Proceed kit with medical supplies. KG is tending to Jin's wound. It's lighter than I thought. Does it hurt Jin? It doesn't, but I want to have Big Sis Sarah heal it for me. Well, now, got me in a sore spot. Wouldn't like this should be fine, just being washed under water and bandage. I have a self that speeds up cellular repair, so if you use that as well, it will more quickly. Sure, that's not dangerous? Yeah. Understood. Please look at this. She cut her own hand, making it bleed! Use it like so in the bleeding area. See, it isn't dangerous, is it? Proving it with your own body, huh? Eh, uh, I don't like that. That is so creepy. Jen and Keiji are talking in whispers. Mr. Policeman. What's up? Is it okay to give Big Sister this? What is it? No, better not give her that. I wonder what they're talking about. Do you have something for me? It's nothing! I think it has something to do with Joe. I really do. I'm very curious. I feel like it would be bad if I didn't. If I left this doubt just lingering, I feel like it would be really bad. Show me that, Jin. No, I can't. Come on, please. And his hand was... It's... 
I knew it. I knew it. Why? Why did- I thought something bad would happen if I- Oh my. The dog keychain he always kept in his breast shop. The one I gave Joe. I picked it up then. I didn't want the kidnappers to take it. I'm sorry. I literally did that to myself. I'm so freaking stupid. I am so stupid. Why did I not just leave him alone? Why? Why did I- I literally said- I- Okay, I, I'm not even gonna- Jin, you did well. Is it okay if I take this? You're glad? Yeah. This is precious to me. Thank you, Jin. Dude, he looks so happy. Yeah, KG's like, nah, this no helping it, I guess. Bro. Ah. What was that? Calm down, I gotta stay calm. Oh, we've treated Jin, so let's leave. Right. If you get hurt, please come back again. Thank you. Thank you, we'll make use of it again. There's no reason to thank her. It's because these guys are getting hurt. Okay, that's true. I was just being polite. Apologies. Let's go, you two. I am so dumb. We left the medical office behind. <sighs> okay. What's wrong? Rico's glancing at me to call me over. I wonder what it is. What's wrong? Sarah, can you come with me for a sec? What is it? It's in a weird place. I wanted to show you before telling everyone. A weird place? Come on, follow me. What? What is this SCP crap? What is this? I told you, weird, right? The most suspicious part is those stairs. There's a vending machine at the top. A vending machine? Aren't any items displayed inside and no prices showed the power's on. A vending machine with no clear merch or prices. The hell is it? It's deal, you think? The bill acceptor slot is plugged up. But it looks like you can put it in coins. Ah, uh, yeah. Tokens, yep. What should we do? Put in some tokens? Hold on a sec. I don't think we should do anything yet. It might be a trap. Just touching it could be bad. Sure, but like, before the others come in and get all curious... Don't do it, Rico. In the end, somebody's gotta investigate it. Rico, why? Nothing's happening. No! No! Stop! Stop it. Seeing as there's a number above it, maybe you have to insert 200 tokens? How are you gonna get 200 tokens? That better be one goddamn tasty soda. Maybe there's no need to worry about it. Got a point. 200 is just unreasonable. No problem ignoring it, then. Oh, well, isn't that a relief? Let's ditch this creepy place. Rico, yeah? I took the token she inserted from the return slot. And gave it back to Rico. Hey, thanks. Now, let's move, Sora. Alright. Maybe we can come back if we solve the mystery. Besides, it's about, a t it's about time I did an attraction. Alright. Um... Seems like this forest still got plenty of hidden areas. Alright, um, we did hide and seek. Get past obstacles to get in the way of the minecart and reach the goal within the time limit. Ah, I can't... Okay. Being nimble, the cart advances faster. Reselect. <laughs> um, I don't like the idea of working with him. Increases the appearance rate of speed-up icons. Huh. In wait, increases your attack power? Wait, what did he say? Wait, wait, hold on, what, the, what, what did he say? I know, Sarah, if you partner up with me, I'll trade 10 me tokens while we're at it. Um, let me think. So it didn't say anything. Yeah. No, what? Okay, let me see what stay on target does. Reiko, Alice, and so. As so, the charge speed while in the area increases. No! No. <laughs> Bro, Stu is asking for stuff. 
I barely trust you. You think I'm gonna give you- Nah. As Alice, you get one extra health? Bro, everyone is being so freaking picky. Oh my god. Get out of here. Your great concentration makes the movement of the area feel slower. Hey, Sarah. Yeah. Yeah. Um... Let me just read the rules again for this game. First, I'm gonna save in another slot. Um, stay on target. Stay within the bounds of the areas produced by your opponents. Defeat the three dolls to win. Okay, yeah. Let's go with Rico. As Rico, your great concentration. Yep. Let's do it. Just gotta put stay put in this one, yeah? Motion and stillness. I'll show you how good I am at both. Dude, Rico is so cool. I love her so much. Okay. We'll start with me. What it, what am I looking at? Keep touching the area presented by your opponent, just following it and not leaving the bounds. Touching your allies icon will give you advice and, and the like, so good luck. Um is this what I have to do? I don't understand. Am I doing this right? Am I... I... I can't tell if I'm doing this right. Oh, am I supposed to be clicking? I am supposed to be clicking. Okay, okay, okay. It was not properly explained at all that that was that they they do that okay oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh dude it's so much harder as sarah because sarah doesn't have any abilities she's just kind of there like all right all right all right all right, all right. we're doing pretty good we're doing pretty good nice Okay. Um. What? What? This is so weird. What is this one? Ah, oh, dude, that thing is gross. What? What is happening? That is so disgusting. Ah. Oh. <laughs> what the heck? All right. Oh my god. Ah. Oh. oh, it's stretching everywhere, man. It's so gross. Ah. Oh. Oh, it's so gross. At least I know the pattern. Still, it's ah. Oh. I hate that thing, man. That is so weird. <laughs> All right, one more. What the hell is that? Oh my god. What? What? Why am I taking damage? Oh my gosh, dude. I feel like this one is just so unresponsive. Or you have to be in a certain area of it, it feels like. You can't just be anywhere. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, I have to blink. I have to blink so bad. Oh my gosh, I have to blink. I have to blink. Ah! You are not helping! I have to blink! Ah! I'm trying so hard not to blink right now. Oh my god! Ah! I'm so close! Okay. Oh. Oh my gosh. Ah, dude, my, my eyes are actually tearing up. That was horrible. Reiko, you are goaded. Actually, thank you so much for doing that with me. Hell yeah, piece of cake, Sarah. Sorry to be selfish, but I'm taking two queer chips. To make up for it, I'll give you 30 tokens. Alright, one queer chip. In that case, I should have talked to Kana. I feel like that trade between us was so redundant. With that, this attraction is done. Oh my god, my eyes still hurt. <laughs> Alright. 
I can't talk to Kana. Damn. Should I? Let me see what everyone else is saying. Sarah, I'll give you 30 tokens. Let's play together. Okay, hold on. No, 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 no. Sarah, want to trade? Oh my god, everyone just wants to trade. Sarah, it's not a trade, but you want to talk? Here, short pitch. I just want to chat. You need breaks, right? A break. Eh, I can't. I have to do something productive. Sarah, you want to trade tokens? How about 20? you would be doing what Ranger and company say, but I was thinking I'd gather up tokens. What does it sound? 20 ain't so many, is it? Eh. Nah. Um, 30 tokens. Here a short pitch. An idea. I don't want to trade tokens, but I thought of how to use them meaningfully. Whoever plays with me gets 30 tokens, so it's not a trade. Wow. Um. I am not going to get another opportunity to do this with either Qtaro or Jin, am I? I'm gonna go with Jin because it's not a trade. He just wants to play. That that's the better option, right? Or would that endanger Jin? That would help us. I don't want to endanger anyone here. Oh my god. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it with Jin. Let's play. I just have to play? Yeah, for 30 tokens, I'm buying your time. <laughs> then I better provide some serious fun. Tag. Let's play tag. I'm it. Steal yourself. Alright, bring it on, Jin. Wait, Big Sisera. As if. That way's a dead end. What? I uh, ran at a moderate speed. I'll dodge you. As if. You hesitated. What? Bro, how fast is this kid? Oh my god. I caught Big Sisera. Not bad at all, Jin. Since I won, now you gotta do everything I say. I didn't promise that. Come to think of it, you didn't. Close one. Jin and I sat down. Big Sisera, are you tired? A little. It's fun being with you. Thanks. That's why I want you to accept my tokens. You won't trade tokens, will you? Yeah. Please, Big Sisera, accept them. There's no merit in refusing. Yeah. Got it, Jin. You bought a fun time with me. Let's say that was it. Yeah. But it's only a one-time payment. I'll play with you for free next time, Jin. <coughs> gotcha. I'll play using Big Sis Sarah. Didn't he misspeak, or...? Oh, well. <laughs> well, that's it for negotiations. Alright. It's gotten late already. I can't even maintain concentration. I guess I'll call it the day. Good night. Huh? There's some commotion going on outside. What could have happened this late at night? Sarah, it's terrible. What? What happened? The old guy... Was killed? Huh? Come to the monitor room. The old guy... The... The... Why is it broken? Mishima's monitor is broken. What is this? Who would do something? No good. Seems the computer in front is just for booting up. The AI was stored on the monitor itself. Mishima can't be booted up anymore. Why would someone do that? How is- what? So, you did this, didn't you? What? You're wrong. I would never do such a thing. Um... Kano was with him this whole time, so it wasn't so. Always with him? This late into the night? It's Kano's job to watch him, so we slept in the same room. What? I was worried, because she wouldn't let me leave. Though it ended up giving me an alibi, huh? It wasn't so? I'm beat. Oh my god, I freaking clicked through it. Who was the first to discover this? That'd be this policeman here. It was you, Keiji? What was the situation? Oh, well... I couldn't get to sleep, so I thought I'd have a chat with Mishima. When I came in, well, it looked just like this. Is that true? Yeah. It's a shame. It really is. What is this? Why do I get the sense... KG is telling a bare-faced lie? Um... Has something happened? Oh my god. Don't come in! Huh? Professor? Dude, why? Why? Why is this game doing this? I'm not gonna say anything. 
I don't know what I should say. Professor Mishima is... Um... Please don't look for the culprit. What do you mean by that? Please let me be alone for a while. Now? No clues around that I can see. No bits of wood on the ground, like when the other monitor got broken. Nothing. So the evidence was cleaned up this time? This one is a nonsensical accident. Would love to solve it right away, but... We need rest. Let's do a detailed investigation tomorrow. Asking Reiko and Kyutaro can wait till tomorrow, too. Policeman, you gotta find the culprit. Right. We'll find out who it was, for now's sake especially. What does she mean by he told a lie? I didn't even think he was lying. Because everything he said up until now has- he said it for a reason. So if he is lying, it can't be for a bad reason. At least that's what I think. Okay. Yep, I don't know crap. Looks like Keiji is questioning her about the incident yesterday. Can't talk to the old guy anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Got nothing else to say. Okie dokie, I'll trust you. Sarah, need something from me? Uh... <laughs> are you flirting? Have you learned anything? Nope, I don't know a thing. It's a real pickle. Seems Kutara doesn't know either. I'll keep up the investigation. See ya. Oh, he's gone. Sarah, I've got something for you. Can you come with me for a sec? Huh? What? I found something curious here. Something curious? It's hard to see in the dark, but check out that wall. It's a button. There's a mysterious switch on the wall. Notice the switch there? What's this for? I don't know, but there's an interesting note here. What? Oh, the switch are the words bonus attraction. No, don't push it. This time it could be a trap. Yeah, but bonus. It's curious, right? You take it at face value, I thought it might be worth betting on. Sure, but... Man, I can't ignore it when it's so intriguing. I- Bro, you gotta stop doing things that first pop into your head! Don't do it, Reiko! Don't look so worried, okay? Step back, Sarah. Reiko pushed the switch. The loud sound, something moved. A door? There's a door? A door appeared? Is that... There's a piece of paper on the door. It reads, Room of Lies. <laughs> I'm not going in that room, bro. I'm not. Room of Lies? It's a tenth attraction. What the hell's going on here? Shouldn't there be nine attractions? Yeah, we heard that, but... And six queer ships? It's awfully suspicious, isn't it? Hey, Sarah. Did you check all nine attractions? Yeah, I did. Specifically, how many queer chips you you get from each attraction? Out of the nine attractions, seven give two, one gives three stars, and one gives five stars. Right. And all the attractions got to be done in pairs. Right. You've noticed yet? There's nine of us. That's an odd number. A person can't re-enter an attraction once they've already cleared it. So each attraction will always end up with one person who can't do it. Even if everyone who can form a pair goes around to every attraction, the number of queer chips we can get is 84. For nine of us to win requires 90. So we're, sh we're short six. At least one person will die from not having enough. I thought about that. I thought about that, but I didn't want... Oh my god. Why? This game, bro, I can't. Six, then... If we beat this bonus attraction, it gives us exactly enough. And we have to risk dying to do it. Ain't no logic in avoiding this place, Sarah. If we hadn't discovered this attraction, someone would have died. And now it's just who does it. Who? Of course I'll do it. Reiko! And who to pair up with? Well, so can't be trusted for shit. Yeah, thank you for saying that. Jin, Kana, and now don't want to put him in danger. Yutara probably needs compensation to convince. That guy's a realist. What about Keiji? No offense, Sarah, but I can't trust that guy. He's hiding something. Yeah, I completely understand that. I'm not blindly trusting Keiji either. He's definitely, like, he's doing things for his own personal reasons. I can understand that. But I don't think he's a bad person, straight up. He has, you know, his own goals and stuff, obviously, but we can't entirely trust him. We can't just blindly trust him. So she is right. 
She is right. I really wish I could save. I want to say I'll pair, or I'll pair with her. I've already paired with her. I know that's, like, I should try being with everyone as much as I can. But I don't want to leave her with Alice. I don't, because they're not going to have any coordination at all. That's going to end horribly, and someone can die in here, as it said. If you do this wrong, someone will die. So I'll pair with her. I don't even have to think about it. I'll pair with you. You can't do that, Sarah. Why? Why not? You're overworking yourself. You've saved our asses again and again, and I'm supposed to be older. I'm empathetic. I want to be equals with you, Sarah. It won't satisfy me to just keep getting saved. Then don't be modest. I want to say that, but I feel like she's going to react negatively if I say that. And go with the most trustworthy? What does that even mean? I'm going to say don't be modest. Then please don't be modest. You should choose the best option. If that's not me, then I understand. Sarah, I'm afraid to just wait around, too. You sure? You got the stamina for this? Yes. Hell yeah, I'm in your debt, because really, I couldn't imagine anyone but you. Let's beat this and come out safe. I grabbed Reiko's outstretched hand and gave her a firm handshake. Then a liquid trailed onto my hand? Through a gap in Reiko's glove? It was blood! That was when I finally noticed?! Reiko had scratches and bruises in inconspicuous places all over her body? She had been pushing herself. No doubt she challenged the attractions to earn clear chips for the powerless of us, like Jin and Nao. And surely there were more wounds on the thin hands of those gloves. Reiko. What's up, Sarah? Forget it. Let's go. Nah, bro. That is so messed up. After I clear this one, I'm ending the episode. <sighs> okay, um... I gotta think about this. This this is actually stressing me out. Let's go. This is the Room of Lies? Pretty dark. You there, Sarah? Yeah, let's look around carefully. There's a table in the center of the room. Eh, no. Yep, yeah, I have to. Okay. I approach and examine the top of the table. These are clear chips. And on the right is a rope? On top of the plate with the rope-like object on it, there was also a note. This is the Web of Happiness. In the final attraction, it may just save your lives. The Web of Happiness? It's astoundingly suspicious. Is it safe to touch? No. I shouldn't go carelessly touching them. Can I talk to... Dude, I, I can't. There's nothing else I can do. I have to. Yeah. Oh my god. Alright, yeah, I, ha I have to. It's not going to give me another option. Rachel, let's take the items from the table. Wait, in that case, let's do it together. Okay, well... Rachel, you take the clear chips. Got it. Okay. I took the whip of happiness. Yep, the lights went out. I expected that. Suddenly, the lights went out. Huh? Reiko! Sarah, run away! Reiko! What's happening? I shook for Reiko's hand at once and grabbed it. Let's run to the exit, Reiko. What happened? Are you alright, Re- What? Reiko's glove? Reiko? She's still in the Room of Lies! Oh my god. I need to bring somebody. Huh. What? Scary sh Are you okay, Rico? Uh, yeah, I wasn't scared. Something the matter, Sarah? As long as you're okay. Relax, I didn't drop the clear chips. Sure enough, she has all six. Got a cold sweat when it went pitch black. Why don't you tell anybody I was freaking out? I wonder if she doesn't like the dark. But I wonder what that was, you know, like, the lie part. Are the clear chips fake? Are these clear chips the lie? Maybe they're fakes or something. Are you serious? They look real to me, though. What are we gonna do about these dubious clear chips? I was thinking I'd give somebody who was having trouble collecting them, but... Sarah, you need one? Huh? Look, I get being wary, but you've got a right to have some.
I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take the clear chip. Because if this thing is dangerous in any way to Reiko, I do not want her getting hurt any more than she's already hurt. I'm gonna take it. We both risked our life and limbs for these. I'll take one. Obtained one clear chip. There you go. Reiko's hand. Wait, this glove. It's not yours, Reiko? What's that? Rico's already wearing gloves on both hands. Yeah, that's mine. Why have you got it, Sarah? When I pulled your hand earlier, I... I'm pretty sure nobody pulled my hand. Then, what's this glove? It must be one of my spare gloves. Your spares, really? Yeah, Ranger put a full change of clothes in our rooms, remember? Though I don't remember bringing this. I gave Rico her glove back. What? Then what was that? Thanks, anyhow. We should get going, Sarah. What the hell? No use in worrying about it. Maybe it's time to do an attraction. I wonder if KG found the culprit. Can't talk to the old guy anymore. Yeah. Okay. Like I said, I'm gonna save. Thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys are thinking of the content so far. And as always, we'll see you all next time. See ya.